Hi there, this is my first more serious uh, Netduino video. In this uh, video I'm using more advanced components, namely um, the Blink M here. Um, it's a microcontroller and a uh, very bright RGB LED on a small um, board there. And it's being controlled by the Netduino over the two green lines which you can see there. Those are I2C data and clock lines um, which can be used to send byte commands to the Blink M and also receive um, commands back from the Blink M. Uh, in this example, I've also I've got the uh, five volt power and a ground line, um, which is used simply to power the Blink M, and I've also got an external switch, which you can see here. Um, for this video, um, when I toggle the external switch, um, the Blink M plays a sort of basic set of um, colours back. Um, it plays red, green, blue, uh, cyan, magenta, I think. Um, and when I toggle that switch off again. Um, that sequence is told to stop. Um, similarly, if I uh, press the onboard switch, um, the Blink M plays a more advanced um, set of uh, instructions. Um, in this one, it sort of simulates um, a lightning storm, and um, you'll see that when I do that. And uh, when I press the switch again, that sequence is also told to stop. Um, so to demonstrate this, I will put this. Um, little paper cover over the Blink M just to make it more obvious. You can see the colours better. I can just get that on there. There we go. And I'll also dim the lights for a better effect. So here we go. I'll flick the external switch first. And there you can see red, yellow, green, blue, that's magenta back to red again and the cycle continues until I click the switch off again and similarly I'll choose the onboard switch this time and then you'll see sort of blue tones and there's your lightning I'll let you see that again it's quite smart there you have it and I click that off and the sequence shuts down again. Um, the Blink M is really smart, it's uh, incredibly bright and it's also got a lot of onboard commands including returning values um, such as the current colour, um, its address on the line um, and I plan to use it a lot more in uh, projects to come so thanks for watching and stay tuned.